Yes! We're gonna make it! Yes! Why? Be gone, you filthy fueled creature! Go, I say! <laughs> And welcome to another walking with Jen and Ollie. Um, today, <laughs> just a hand. Um, today we're in Balcom. We've just started at Balcom Station, but we're actually walking to the Aus Valley Viaduct. So um, if we come this way, we can see uh, the walk here, um, and it shows the viaduct just here. So we can get a very cool perspective shot of us on the viaduct, which we'll she'll show you a little bit later. So we're taking the very sensible step instead of having an actual map of just having a little like a little step by step thing going on. We just need to work out which way we're going. Up there I think. Yeah, so he went this way. Aha! Uh -huh. Down here! Ball field. I don't think there are any balls, but we're not gonna piss about just in case. I am. <laughs> <laughs> Ollie's not a fan of cows. <laughs> As we know from the cow po various cow apocalypses and COVID cows COVID in cows, our past. That's right. Let's not. <laughs> wow. <laughs> To remember the guy. Not a footpath. <laughs> this is not a public path. <laughs> no, it's He's a gonna... hunting ground for your dead birds. <laughs> He's going to be here, Ali. You it's... need to remain in that bush. Oh, yes. Freaky shack devil. I know. What the fuck? This is somebody's. Oh, it's got woodworm. Nip, 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 nip. <laughs> This is the reservoir. This is Ardingly Reservoir. Oh, wow, okay. And somebody's got their, oh my god, wow. Somebody's got their greenhouse just fucking facing the reservoir. How beautiful. There is a resident dinosaur. <laughs> oh, cute. What are you doing? I, it's weird because he's got like a T-Rex head, but then a raptor arm. Mm. Oh, it's their own version of a dinosaur. Wow! That'd be so much fun. To, to do what with? <laughs> slide, slide yeah, on. Yeah, yeah definitely yeah. slide. That's exactly what would happen. <laughs> and then you go into like the drop pool. And you get stabbed by that tree. <laughs> yeah. But you'll be happy. Just <laughs> <laughs> don't pull it out. off the road here, turn right um, and this will be the walk trail alongside the Ardingley Reservoir and there are horses oh, going on this trail. Um, Claire thee the bridal way. Doesn't want to declare itself. It's okay. This rock interests me. It seems to have a lot of uh, character. Imagine this thing just rolling towards you. It's just a step, just a casual step. What, what could the consequences be? <laughs> I named this rock Rodney. No, Sir Rodney Rockington. Goodbye, sir. I, don't, I bid you a good day. Yeah. <laughs>
Good day. And good day to you. <laughs> Here is part of the reservoir. We're currently walking along the Kingfisher Trail along the side of uh, the reservoir and all the little streams and stuff that go into it. Um, this is a horse track as well, as you can probably see from some of the markings on the ground. Um, <laughs> yeah, you hope you don't meet any of them. I, right. I hope I do. You see all the pheasants ahead of us, just like running away. <laughs> yeah, I mean you hear the gunshots in the... Yeah, fair, huh? Like, fair dues for any. So we're looking for a bridge that we need to go over. We haven't yet, we couldn't possibly have missed a bridge, could we? No, 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 <laughs> Every single thing we've passed has been like no public access, anglers only. So there is no other way, public footpath like this, that we could have gone. You hear a train in the background. Oh, train. <laughs> Why? <laughs> <laughs> God damn. <laughs> yes, I got a bum shot. I'm not sorry. <laughs> so we came across this short section of road over the bridge, and now we're just going down towards the other part of the Ardingly Reservoir Pass. Um, as you can see, reservoir just in the background there. Hopefully you guys can see. Now we're going to stick on this path for a little while. So here we are at the other side of the reservoir, uh, walking back this way. Um, you obviously could get right up close to it, but it's pretty muddy and also uh, it's a point for like wildlife and stuff and birds there. So. Won't get too close unnecessarily, can stick on the footpaths here. Um, and at some point we'll get round to where the Alps Valley Viaduct is, which is hopefully the crown jewel of this walk. The reservoir is pretty cool as well. Yeah. If you just if you just like jump across them quickly enough, you could sort of like <laughs> get out at least to the middle of the reservoir without getting wet. <laughs> then you can fly. That's, that's how physics works. <laughs> distracted. So apparently we're looking for some kind of car park. Okay, so like in theory giant, we can't... Sorry, with giant car park. Giant car park. Just like giant, I mean, uh, obviously you get like kind of like shopping centre car parks that have like thousands of spaces. I don't know how giant we're talking here. <laughs> Time will tell. We have the car park on the left. Let's do the checking of map thing. We have the reservoir on the right. And the birds, you can see in the distance. Be careful here guys, I think we need to make sure that we go to the left of this tree and not back away from the viaduct. Oh yeah, there's a boatyard there and we've come past this metal gate where up here, not to the right but there's to also the left. A little Road. Yes, there's so, a sort of... Uh, there's almost three options. <laughs> so you take the middle option basically, but also use a map or a guide. Don't just don't just like play this video in the friggin' background. Like you're not gonna get you're not gonna do well. I can tell you right now. Do not take our advice. Please don't. We are not responsible people. You're thinking about all the cowboy we're sitting in. Mm. Cowpoo! Adding to it. Cowpoo bread coming up. Bushy. So that's 
It's that time of year, isn't it? A little cheese sandwich, what you got all? Uh, ham and mustard bagel. Nice. Yeah. I mustard. I wanted that! Oh no! Oh no! The horse! It was not worth it! Right. You're banished from jokes. Right, so we're going to so apparently we should be able to start seeing the Alps Valley Viaduct. Is this the bridge we're going over? We go, yeah. Cool. Very natural, I love it. <laughs> so uh, just in the distance here, um, hopefully the camera is picking it up, uh, we can just see the beginning of that viaduct. Um, yeah, pretty cool. And this is the Alps Valley Viaduct. Yes, we're going to make it. Um, I'm going to add some info below uh, in the description if you guys want to know any more about the history of the viaduct. Check it out below. Um, we're going to get up a little bit closer. Awesome is this? Damn. That was smooth, right? <laughs> Super smooth. Wow. They're massive. And the echoes. Amazing optics. Whoa. Climbing skills may happen. <laughs> here we are together at the Alps Valley Viaduct. Uh, it's a pretty cool spot. I've got my arm here. <laughs> I don't know what's going on there. Here we are. Slightly oh, sorry, we're still here. Sorry. <laughs> at the Alps Valley Viaduct. Um, what we're going to do is like leap from pillar to no. Oh yeah, no fair. We're not going to do that. But we are going to get some funny pictures from perspective, so wow. I'm excited about that. Is actually even higher than the one we just jumped up. Here it is. That is quite a lot higher. Yeah. The bounce like all the freaking way through and through there. All the way. Do we come to a river in the middle? Maybe we do. There's a sort of dip of some description. We ain't getting any further unless we want to get pretty scrambly. Mm. Yes. When you get like to the partway, halfway point, essentially, uh, you come to the river. Obviously, it's not that difficult. You could get across it, but um, not loving the idea of wet feet, mid, mid walk. So I think we'll we'll vibe out if you're in agreement. Tom. I am Tom, you are, that's so unique, I can see why you had to whack your stamp up there, <laughs> like, thank God, and look, I mean, even the, the height has increased again. Wow. <laughs> it's crazy, isn't it? Let me, do it? let me show it against you, for comparison, yeah, you saw what it was against Ollie before, and now it's increased again like I think it would be actually a struggle without a boost to get up there now. Exactly. Tom's proper 
climbed up like the... And how the fuck did he get up there? He must have had a mate boost in him. Awesome. <laughs> Let's just crow. fucking find out then. Brilliant. <laughs> Death by cows. Death coming up. <laughs> they heard us coming. They heard. <laughs> they heard us coming. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in danger. <laughs> My last wishes. Um, don't oh, across. Oh, you're right. Right. Giddy up. Fuck it out. Hmm, cows. You alright, guys? You alright guys, don't worry. It's alright. No big deal, you all just keep chill, we all keep chill. They're actually pretty chill to be fair. Yeah. Okay darling, don't you worry. Sorry mate, I should let you go first and think about that. I'm going to face my fear right now. We did it, we did it. Well done guys. Thank you for keeping the you're still in there, Phil. <laughs> still on the front side of the face. Yeah. I hope this is the right one. I mean, I did get you to double check the directions, but when you're looking at a bridge like this, yeah. you're like, is it the right one? <laughs> yeah. It is now. Oh, I'm still afraid. Well done. As you were. So we did oh, go we across are. the right bridge. Okay, that's after, after the fear, right? Back. Back. <laughs> <laughs> Whether or not it's meant to be this way, we're going this way. <laughs> Oh God! <laughs> <laughs> scary! There is some more flulloping in the music. No! More flulloping! I don't want to fall off the floor! I don't want to get away from these guys! Okay. There might even be more in here, you know? Ah! We're like, decided this is a safe field. We don't know. Yeah, we? Yeah. You're right. <laughs> Good to know. Hey, we're going right. Right on, right on. Ooh, cool. These mushrooms. What do you think they are? It's a very pleasant day. Okay, is this what is this what she was meaning by the long uphill? Yeah, it's got photos. What's happening? It's exciting. Is this the same picture? No, no. not quite yet. Oh, but it will be. Some almost hidden wooden Nice. <laughs> that middle bit was not clear. Is this the picture? Oh, okay. Burn it. It's been really useful. It's it has just, been useful. Yeah. Yeah, in the moment, fire. Thank you to the guide maker. That is actually very helpful. We've put your link in the description below. Um, all my grumblings. Uh, some of the differences are because of difference of season, vegetation. Mm. Uh, some areas have been blocked off or diverted because of mud and stuff like that. So. Obviously, just when you're doing any route, just be aware of those kind of potential differences. Um, but overall, this route ha uh, map has been pretty useful with all the pictures and everything. So. so I think we are definitely over halfway at this point, aren't we, Oz? Maybe three quarters of the way? Yeah. Yeah. Um, and obviously making our way back now, circularly, on towards Balcombe train station. Um, so a lot of this return walk is again uh, via kind of pretty fields, um, it being pretty sunny, uh, the views are pretty nice. The view of the viaduct from here, which I can definitely see. <laughs> Apparently I need better glasses, or like any, when, I, when I'm walking. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
Nice. Yeah, this is cool. Look at this. Just out of nowhere, there's like, here's some really cool rock. Yeah. Oh. Oh, Ali. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> okay. A lot of pheasants around here, and a little bit of cave. That guys. <laughs> okay, make sure I pick up my flask once all this is said and done, please. All right, let's go have a little look. careful of my footing here to be honest so as you can see uh, without having something to hold my camera out of my hand I can't I don't have enough hands to actually get up any further but it is a dead end but it's quite a cool little cover like little mini cave for pheasants and other creatures yeah. very ready yes um, so yeah obviously I could get up like cave style but like I have my thing on my hand so I can't really do that yeah hold on but then I'd that's okay I can see from the back mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. it's slippery it's slippery it's slippery I like it. Ariba. Ariba. She's sliding. She's sliding. <laughs> yes! Okay. Okay. She's not a Have a haunted cornfield. Time for this season. No, it's just it's just the edges. Like the rest of it is cut down. Yes. Why do you do that? Privacy. So it comes up on you and you don't know it's there until it's we can't hear you. <laughs> <laughs> Everywhere we go, there are like several pheasants ahead of us running away. You know, like London pigeons, they'll just be like, oh, okay, we're just going to move this way, and then <laughs> you walk by. These guys just keep going. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Absolute idiot. <laughs> All right, here is the road. At this point, there's a decision to make whether you want to walk back to the station along the road or go quieter route through some houses. Uh, we prefer houses I think. So yeah. Um let's find those. Woohoo! Almost back <laughs> oh, really? Are we right here? Remember the initial way I wanted to go? Yes, are we here? Do you remember that yeah thing? yeah the like, the poo bin we almost went the, the 313 Poobin. We almost I <laughs> nearly reversed our walk. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Woo. So here we are back at Balcom Station. Uh, we finished our walk around Ardingley Reservoir and the Alce Valley Viaduct. Uh, hope you enjoyed the walk. It took us around about five and a half hours uh, with lots of rest breaks, photo breaks, and a photo shoot on the reservoir. Um, so thanks so much for coming along with us, hope you enjoyed the journey, um, follow me if you want any more adventures, walks, caving, climbing, everything like that, um, and hope to see you soon.